Hello, this is Stampy, Fire! and welcome to my let's play of Disney Infinity. Pirates! Pirates, ladies and gentlemen, pirates. Yes, indeed. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, let's go get some plunder, shall we? I'm doing the uh, Pirates of the Caribbean playset. Uh, I just finished the uh, Monsters University playset, and I had jolly good fun with that. And uh, I'm looking forward for a change of scenery, though. I'm looking forward to, to going into the land of pirates, here controlling Captain Jack Sparrow. Oh, this is awesome. What an opening. <laughs> right. Onwards and upwards, then. I seem to have a, uh, a small cannon on the front of my tiny bow. And whoa! It's getting pretty dangerous down here. I have no idea what's going on. I literally loaded it up, and we've gone straight into this uh, action here. And uh, I've just started sailing. I've just started following the arrow. So it's certainly a, a more dramatic opening uh, compared to the uh, the Monsters University playset. <laughs> I suppose this one's uh, likely to be a lot more actiony. This looks dockable. I guess this is where we're where we're gonna land. I like the uh, the voice actor for a uh, Cap and Jack Sparrow. <laughs> Obviously not Johnny Depp, but trying very hard to be. <laughs> anyway, worry, we've docked. <laughs> and we we have landed. Always good for a laugh. It's a good thing you're here. I sir, but I'm afraid we brings bad news about our Mr. Gibbs. He's not dead or nothing. Just been locked in solitary confinement, all. Poor blighter. But he knows where to find him. Follow us. These are two of my favourite characters from the uh, from the parts of the Caribbean franchise. I'm just going to very quickly uh, just go turn the the sound up on their voices because they all sounded rather quiet. And I want to make sure that uh, we're going to be able to hear it all properly. And did I actually save it then? I always do that. I always go and adjust it, then just quit and don't actually ever save it. I've done that so many times. Right, onwards and upwards. Hopefully we're going to be able to hear what they're saying now. And look, we're already getting uh, a bunch of stuff. What is it that we collect? I got a uh, Bayou Beauty's hat. We're not hat? able to get ourselves in beyond this point, sir. Might you be able to help us? Uh, yeah, sure. With my gun. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, I like it. This is so different from Monsters University. That's what I love about this game is that like every level you do is like in a completely different world and it can be like totally unique. Like I'm playing the same game, but it just feels all completely new and exciting. I love it. Certainly a very dramatic Captain, opening. We're just coming to a massive battle. If he begs our pardon, I'll pick this here lock while you take down the blackguards. We're with you in spirit, sir. Yeah, you cowards. That's right. Leave me to do all the, the combat. You go and do your lock picking. Oh, they're right here. Oh, it's like skeletons. It's not even just normal pirates. It's skeleton pirates. I don't know if any of you have seen a Pirates of the Caribbean. I'm assuming you most of you have. I'm pretty sure everyone has. And oh no, I think one's got through. Right, take him out. Take him out, you scaraby dogs. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> oh, dear. I need to get into the, the, the pirate mood, I think. Oh, God, I'm getting owned here. I'm not doing very well. I'm a little bit out of practice. I've not played this game in a little while. So, uh, yeah, it might take me a little while to get back into it. Right, let's try and use my revolver. It's pretty slow. It's only like fires one shot at a time. I did it, though. Like I completed like what, like three missions like, already, and I only just like loaded the, the game up. All the right, have they managed to pick Nicely the lock? Done, sir. Right this way. It seems they have. This place is massive. I wonder if this is going to be like all open world. I wonder if I'm going to be able to explore like my whole way round here. The place seems huge, though. I'm rather excited about this, to be honest. It's a bit more than we bargained for, uh, but you'll find Gibbs up in that tower. Right, let's go save Gibbs then. He's a man in need. Uh, the compass points uh, in the direction of your mission objective. I don't have a compass, do I? Where's my compass? <laughs> That's all fair enough if the compass pointed in the right direction, but if I can't see the compass, it's not going to help me. Oh, look, I've collected a bit of a boat. Maybe I get to collect boats. Like, surely I'm going to be able to sail at some point. Surely I'm going to be able to sail the, uh, the seven seas. Uh, let's try and open this chest then if I can. I'll shoot it open. I seem to be solving most problems with my gun. It's like, you can't open the door. Shoot it open. You can't open the chest. Shoot it open. <laughs> oh dear, I wonder what else I could solve by just shooting at it. You need to clean the windows. Just shoot them and break them, then they don't need to be cleaned. <laughs> oh, it's amazing how many things in life you can solve by shooting a gun at it. <laughs> I don't recommend doing that in real life though. Oh, oh god, it looks like the, the ground got destroyed. A little bit of platforming. That's not what I want. Uh, everyone who's seen my Minecraft video knows that I am officially the world's worst player at platforming so and I want to try and avoid that I seem to be going in the right direction and oh no I think that actually helped me to be fair I think that was locked so I don't know if that was my boat or the enemy boat but whoever fired that cannon jolly good sir well done and look at the way I run as well I actually properly run like Captain Jack Sparrow <laughs> oh I love it 
Right, okay, I guess we're gonna have to shoot my way through here. Uh, shoot by pressing right trigger. Yeah, I know. Like, to get to this point, I've had to shoot multiple people. And don't try and run away from me. I'm gonna get him. You can't escape. Oh god, I'm just gonna shoot the stairs next to him rather than taking him out. <laughs> right, I'm, like, they've literally just thrown me straight into, like, a, a rather dangerous and exciting situation. Hopefully the game will keep the pace up. And it looks like we're almost right at him. He's, he's pretty much just directly above me in this tower here. Now I just need to, to find my way up to him. And look at the size of this place. This looks absolutely awesome. If you have no idea what this game is, by the way, uh, it's basically like lots of uh, Disney characters and levels all thrown together. And uh, at the moment, I'm playing through uh, some play sets, uh, which were basically like the uh, the pre-made gotcha. levels. Uh, but there's also uh, a level editor as well. And so uh, soon I'll be, go I'll be going through and playing uh, levels that have been made by like a whole load of different people and that as well. So uh, yeah, that's the reason why I, I was doing all uh, Monsters University stuff. Keep and now I've I switched over to, to Pirates. Uh, I can see him he's in there. I can see him just through the other side of the here, gate. <laughs> I guess I need to, to climb my way Don't up here. Down, Captain. Right, and then shoot my way through here. Uh, B to drop down to ledge. I told you I've not played it for a little while. I've forgot all of the uh, the basic controls. And another mission down. I am blazing my way through this. I'm sailing my way through this, you should say. <laughs> Sadly, no. I found its hiding place, sure enough, but was caught breaking in to get it. We'd best be off if we want to beat Davy Jones to the map. Elsewise, he'll be on his way to collecting the treasure. A treasure like that is it's more than riches. I Aye, it'd be complete dominion of the sea itself. I love how, like, tiny everyone looks. Like, we do literally look like little toy versions of ourselves. <laughs> like, I don't know, it looks like little miniature versions of everyone. Right, so I guess we've got to get the map then. And he found where the map was, uh, but he got caught trying to get it. So I guess I'm going to have to do it. Uh, jump to start the uh, rail slide. Right, here we go. Woo! And front flip off. Jolly good. <laughs> right. I love the way he's just standing there, totally oblivious to the evil skeleton pirate standing next to him. He didn't even seem slightly bothered by it. And you. Get out of my face. <laughs> Don't mess with me. Right. Let's go speak to him and see uh, where right we've got to go. The cave with the map be that away. Uh, okay. I guess I got, what, up here, do you reckon? There seems to be, like, the, the edge glowing here. Ah, oh, I see. I climb up here and then edge my way across, do you reckon? I can hear some more skeletons behind me, so I'm going to try and do it as quickly as I can to try and avoid that. And uh, is this where the map is? Is it through here? Oh, who's this Thank guy? You, Captain. Now I'll be taking this map so Davy Jones will be on his way to the prize. If he gets it, you'll be trapped on land forever. What am I doing while he's running? Am I just standing there? Why am I going after him? Is that the Black Pearl? I know that's the, the underwater boat. I can't remember what it's called. Fool! I hope you enjoy your stay on this pittance of an island while I rule the sea. <laughs> Davy Jones stole the map. Summon the Kraken! <gasps> is the Kraken coming now? <laughs> this game isn't slowing down. This is crazy. <laughs> Oh, no, no, I can't chase after him. Do you think he's put that there? Why didn't I go after him? Why did I just stand here? At least I get Flesh the gold. This was entirely unsuccessful. Perhaps Gibbs has fared better. Where has that mutton chopped mongrel gone to? <laughs> oh, I love the dialogue in this game. It just makes me laugh. It seems to be all day then. Everything seems to have brightened up a little bit. So I suppose that's nice. Got some nice happy chirpy music in the background. A nice jaunty pirate seafaring tune. <laughs> Anyway, let's go well, speak it to uh, Gibbs. The map be lost, Captain. Suppose we'll just have to go after the prize itself, and the only one who'll know the route is Tia Dalma. Of course, we'll need a ship to visit her and a bit of shine to purchase said vessel. Hoist the colors, snap to and set sail. You can do much more than that when you get your own ship from the toy store. What's our heading, Captain? Okay, so I guess I need to I need to get some monies and then buy a ship. Oh, this is awesome. I'm having so much fun. So you want, let me let you can have more than one mission open at a time. The mission log will help you keep track of them. Let's Thank open you. it up. From here you can get to both the mission log and the toy store. Open the mission log. Oh, I've done all this before. I'm a seasoned pro at this now. This shows all the missions you've accepted and lets you activate a particular mission. Choose a mission to activate. Once you've activated a mission, the compass will lead the way. 
I suppose it's nice to have a bit of a, a recap. Great. Right, so let's have a quick look in the uh, the toy store and uh, see how much said boat is. It's only 600 gold, and I've already got uh, 433. Uh, so yeah, I only need like, what, like 277 uh, more, then, I, then I'll be sorted. Um, right, what else can I get? Oh, I can like upgrade it. Uh, so I guess I buy the boat, and then I spend all the rest of my money just buying like more stuff for it. Pirate bombs, speed bursts, um, Kraken hammer? So I can summon the Kraken, do you reckon? Awesome, what's that, a fisherman? <laughs> I can unlock a fisherman. Oh, this is awesome, let's get some money then. I guess I'm gonna have to uh, do some side missions in order to get some money. And look how many there are. Look how many missions there are all over the place. Right, let's go speak to someone then. Let's speak to this person. Let's see how I can help her out. That's scurvy David Jones. I hear he destroyed our clock tower. I've got to see it for myself. Mind helping me get up there, Cap'n? Uh, sure, why not? Do you reckon I'm gonna have to carry her up? Do you reckon I can throw people around like I could at Monsters University? Oh, I can! I just pick her up. Right, to the clock tower! <laughs> I don't seem to be holding her very steady. Right, where, where is the, the clock tower then? Where do I have to go? Am I even supposed to, to pick her up? Right, I'll put her down for now. Uh, let me just place her down here. And uh, let me see what it actually says on the, uh, on the mission. I keep pressing start rather than back. Uh, so mission log... Uh, time has stopped. Take the townsperson to the clock tower. Right, if I do show me. Oh, not you. Sorry, wrong person. I don't think I can throw them as far as, uh, Sully could. But to be fair, he is a big, massive blue monster. And this is just a, just a little pirate. So let's pick her up. And there we go. Now I've got a marker showing me to where the clock tower is. Hopefully it's not too far, because I don't walk very quickly. I can't jump either. Do you reckon I can go down here if I just drop? <laughs> can you hear her as well going like, ooh, ah, ooh, like as I carry her. <laughs> like when I drop down, she's like, ah. <laughs> Why can't I just say, follow me? Why do I have to literally, like, raise her above my hat and drag her here? Oh, well, I'm not complaining. As long as she gives me some gold and uh, I can upgrade my boat, then I'm going to be happy. Uh, there we go. I got 50 gold. So it's, what, 600 I needed. And so it's probably going to be, what, like four missions? And uh, then I'm going to be able to do it. Uh, so who should I speak to? There's the guy there who dropped his eye and this guy here with an eye patch. <laughs> oh, God. It's going to be uh, very profitable, uh, profitable to have an opticians in this area, I reckon. Everyone with their eye problems. <laughs> anyway, let's go speak to this guy because he's absolutely hilarious. <laughs> Shush, 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 shush. I, listen, I heard a secret. There's a treasure what's hidden just outside of town. <laughs> oh, oh, really? Tell me more. I bet we finds it first. Ah, you want to race, do you? Right, show me. Where is this, this hidden treasure? Okay, seems to be pretty much where I just was. Um, let's go then. Right. <laughs> Let's just go and head off and try and get it before they do. Like, if they're saying that, I bet they get it first. Why would they even tell me about it? That's the sort of uh, information you want to keep close to your chest about the hidden treasure. <laughs> saying that, like, where the um, old hammerhead shark face went when he went and got the map, there's a load of gold in there. Why couldn't I just take that? I could have bought several boats. I could have had a whole fleet. I could have brought my friends along with me. And uh, I want to make sure I get all of these... Um, these red orbs as well as I go because I think they unlock more costumes and stuff on my boat. There we go. Pirate Carpenter's body. Jolly good. And here is the hidden treasure. It's not very well hidden. I'm kind of surprised no one's found it before me, to be honest. I'd have to shoot it open then, do you reckon, to get it? There we go. Lots of monies. How much is that going to give me? Uh, oh, I'm up to 533. So I think that was another 50 it gave me then. And so, yeah, it should be... Uh, two oh, no, look, there we go. I've got up to 700. I think, I think I can buy my boat already. Yeah, here we go. Press back to access the toy store. And let's go buy my first boat. This is awesome. What's it gonna, what is it called? Player's Pirate Ship. I guess I can give it my own name. Should I, do, you, do you guys want to come up with a name? Do you want to leave some suggestions? Or should I come up with one? I have no idea. I could call it the, uh, the SS Stumpy Mark II. Uh, your ship is found at the delivery platform. Show me. Let's, let's, go, let's go see my boat. I can't believe I bought it. I've not even looked at it. It could be full of holes. We're going to get there. There's going to be like a tiny little like rowing boat covered in moss. Like loads of holes in it and all sorts. And I won't be happy. <laughs> I just paid 600 gold for it. I don't even know what it's going to look like yet. As long as it works. As long as I can sail it. And I can go after. Um, I can't remember what his name was now. Uh, Davy Jones I think it was wasn't it. As long as I can go after him. And uh, try and get the, uh, the map back. Like I, I don't even know what the map's for. Like it said it was going to show me to something that would allow me to control the seven seas. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what that, that would be, but 
Uh, I guess it's going to be pretty useful if, if the whole game is about me trying to go and get whatever this thing is, but uh, the problem with Davy Jones is, as you saw, he kind of has control of the Kraken, uh, which is... Uh, yeah, a squid which you do not want to mess with. He's not like a friendly squid, like ballistic squid. He's a he's a bit of a big, massive, evil octopus fella. So I definitely want to avoid him. And how big is this town? It's absolutely huge. Hopefully, at some point, I get some sort of uh, vehicle or something to like sail around here. Like I don't know, like a a pirate version of rollerblades or something. I don't know what it would be in this time. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe just like a horse and carriage or something, just to uh, to get around quicker. So it's huge. Uh, toy shop packages will be delivered to this platform. Jolly good. Is my boat in this tiny box? I knew it. It's going to be a toy box. And look, look at it. It is it's actually a toy boat. It looked bigger in the picture. Oh, brilliant. All right, everyone hop in. Oh, it's grown. I think it's just grown. I look at the size of it. That'll do me. That'll do me. A few holes in the cell. We can patch them up. I borrowed my mum's sewing kit. No problem. Is that my boat or is it like going to be your boat's behind the big massive grand one? It could do with a few upgrades. I need to patch up the cells. I can add like the speed boost and some cannons and stuff. But overall, I'm pretty happy with that. That's not, that's not a bad sized boat. And who's sailing it? Who's sailing my boat? Go find your ship. Okay, I will do that. Uh, sadly though, uh, I won't be doing it in this video because we have just about run out of time. So uh, yeah, hopefully you uh, enjoyed this introduction to the world of uh, Pirates of the Caribbean uh, inside of Disney Infinity. I I'm loving this so far. I know I've literally just done like just over a quarter of an hour of it, but uh, I already love the world. I think I'm going to have uh, a lot of fun here and a lot of good memories sailing the seven seas and uh, battling evil pirate skeletons. And hopefully uh, you'll join, uh, you're going to join me with my adventure. But that's the end of this video here. There'll be a link in the description to part number two uh, very soon. But I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all later.